question number 20 ipo adhe mari lcm eduthu cross multiply pannanum so what will i have x divided by 2 greater than or equal to 5x minus 2 into 5 minus 3 into 7x minus 3 the whole divided by 15 my lcm is going to be 15 okay so if in the cross multiply panna i'll have 15x divided by 2 greater than or equal to first either multiply pandra 5 into 5x 5 into minus 2 so i have 25x minus 10 minus i'm going to multiply 3 into 7x 3 into minus 3 so i'm going to open a bracket minus irukiradunala i'm opening a bracket so i have 21x minus 9 the whole divided by 15 kadaiyadhu ena 15 multiply paniyaachu now i have 15x divided by 2 greater than or equal to 25x minus 10 ipo minus a ulla multiply panna pora minus 21x plus 9 so minus 21x plus 9 so i have 15x divided by 2 greater than or equal to 25 minus 21 is 4x minus 1 i'm going to cross multiply 2 in the pakkam kondu vandha 15x is greater than or equal to 2 into 4x minus 1 15x is greater than or equal to 8x minus 2 2 into 4x 2 into minus 1 okay 15x minus 8x greater than or equal to minus 2 15 minus 8 panna i'll have 7x so 7x is greater than or equal to minus 2 so x is greater than or equal to minus 2 divided by 7 so x belongs to minus 2 divided by 7 include i minus infinity infinity positive infinity very good so how does your number line look like where is your minus 2 by 7 minus 2 by 7 is nothing but 2 divided by 7 which is going to be 0 0.7214 so 6 0 0.2 so it is going to be somewhere here so this point is my minus 2 by 7 minus 2 by 7 so it is going to be minus 0 0.2 so the point is going to be over here minus 2 divided by 7 and it is greater than minus 2 by 7 so in the point claim the infinity vertical until positive infinity so this is my solution please copy question number 21 this is very similar to example question. First, the equation is frame. Equation is inequation. Okay. Ravi obtained 70 75 marks in the first unit test. So, first test is 70. Second test is 75. Find the minimum marks he should get in the third test. Example question Maria to have an average of at least 60 marks. At least 60 na 60 irkla, 61 irkla and so on. So the condition is greater than or equal to 60. At least 60, 60 you irkano. So equal to over. Okay. Average na 70 plus 75 plus x the whole divided by 3 you have three different marks so the average is divided by 3 total divided by the number of marks so this should be greater than or equal to 60 i'm going to cross multiply so 70 plus 75 plus x is greater than 60 is 18 so 180 70 plus 75 is 145 plus x greater than or equal to 180 please be very careful with the calculation x is greater than or equal to 180 minus 145 what is 180 minus 145 7, 1, 5, 3. So, x is greater than or equal to 35. So, 35 marks are the average 60. Okay. So, what is the range of values? 35 to infinity. Total marks are 100. 35 is 100. This is the range of values. So, x is greater than or equal to 35. So, this is your final answer. Please copy. Question number 22. To receive grade A in one course, one must obtain an average of 90 marks or more in 5 examinations. Each of 100 marks. If Sunita's marks in first four examinations are 87, 92, 94, 95, find the minimum marks Sunita must obtain in the fifth. So, Abdina and Motama average 90 marks. So, she has to either score 90 marks or greater than 90 marks. So, 90, 91, 92 in the Mari, in the exam, but in the class, she has only 87 marks in the first exam. So, fifth exam, I have to average maintain. So, I have average is going to be 87 plus 92 plus 94, plus 95, plus x, the mark that she obtained in her fifth exam, the whole divided by how many exams, Anj, up average is going to be divided by 5, should be greater than or equal to 90. She has to at least have the average of 90. If a cross multiply, first I will add these numbers, 87, 92, 94, 95, 7 plus 2, 9, 9 plus 4, 13, 13 plus 5, 18, 1, 9, 9, 9, 9, 9 4 are 36. 368. So I have 368 plus x greater than or equal to 95 is a 45. So 450. x is greater than or equal to 450 minus 368. So 450 minus 368 in a 4, 1, 2, 3, 1, 14 minus 6 is going to be 8. 
So I have 8 x greater than or equal to 82. So she has to score at least 82 marks to maintain an average of 90. 82 ke kira vanga na 90 average varad. Okay, she'll get something around 89 points something ondro ana 90 varad. So her average, her fifth examination mark has to be at least 82. Lay in the 100 very kum pola. She also can get 100. Okay. 100 is the closed interval. 100 is the closed interval. You should never put a circular bracket. Okay? Next question. Find all pairs of consecutive odd positive integers, both which are smaller than 10. Now, we have an example question. We saw that both of them should be greater than 10. Now, I am going to take one number to be x and other number to be x plus 2. Please watch my example question for better clarity. So, in that way, x to x plus 2. These are my two numbers. So, I have their sum should be more than 11. Upper x plus x plus 2 is greater than 11. This is one condition. What is the other condition? I want x to be less than 10 and x plus 2 to be less than 10. If I solve x less than 10 minus 2, so x less than 8. So, x less than 8, na, I can also choose the number 7, which means it satisfies both the equations. It satisfies 7 less than 10, you satisfy panadhi, you satisfy panadhi. So, what if? I take the first equation. x less than 10 at the end. I can choose the number 9. But does this satisfy this equation? In that case, I have x plus 2 less than 10. When I apply 9. 9 plus 2 less than 11. Sorry, 10. 11 less than 10 which is not true. Upon we the equation for this particular question. You have to choose this particular equation for this particular question. Number smaller than you have to take the larger number. In the example question, you had larger than. In the smaller you had larger than. So at that time we had chosen this particular inequality. Okay. Please be very, very careful on which inequality to choose. So in the particular case, we are going to take x plus 2 less than 10 because that satisfies both the equation. Okay. So I have x plus 2 less than 10. This is my other equation. Okay. So, when I solve 2x plus 2 greater than 11, 2x greater than 11 minus 2. So, 2x greater than 9, x greater than 9 divided by 2. Up x is greater than 4.5. So, x is 4.5 would greater than the other equation. In that way, no equation in x is less than 10 minus 2. So, x is less than 8. What is my range of values? 4.5 less than x, less than 8. Up in the values la We are talking about consecutive odd positive integers. So, what all values can I have? 5, 6, 7. All of the 4 one are the 8 one are the. So, these are all the values that we are dealing with. So, 5, 6, 7 are We are also dealing with consecutive odd positive integers. So, if, if my value of x is equal to 5, x plus 2 and 9 is going to be 7. If my value of x is equal to 7, x plus 2 is equal to 9. Up in the solutions, 5, 7, and 7 comma 9. So, these are my two consecutive odd positive integers such that the number may they are smaller than 10. Rendu number is smaller than 10 and the sum is more than 11. Correct? 5 plus 7 and 12 it is more than 11. 7 plus 9 and 9 it is going to be 16 which is also more than 11. Okay? So, this is my final answer. Please copy.